Hi guys, this is FamilyTuber and today is Tutorial Tuesday and today we're doing another tutorial for how to make your uh, adventure maps better and tips and tricks on that and there's also just random tutorials to make the playing Minecraft better. It's kind of cool. So today we're learning how to do dyed armor. So this only works for leather armor. If you try to do it for anything else, it won't work. Like chain mail, nothing. So what this works is, so I already have it all set up. And what you do is you have to make the dies. And if you don't know how to make the dies, you can go online. Or well, actually in the crafting table, it will show you how to do that. So you don't have to. Uh, that's pretty nice. So what you do is basically is take that die, and let me show you. So you have the cauldron right here, and it's filled with water. What you have to do is take one of the dies, and so let's do red. So that's pretty bright. So basically what you have to do is fill it with water, and then you take the die and basically just click it like you're replacing it. And it would turn red. It's kind of cool. And you can... So that's basically what you can do for the colors. And then how you dye the armor is you just take that. And it see, now the hat is black. And it makes it look pretty cool. So like you can just take it on and it's full on that color. So then you can do it for... This is what gray looks like. This is what... Um, light gray looks like and this is what white looks like so you can do this for your adventure map and it'll just totally uh you can like make your own clothes so it fits the the map better unless you need like better armor so you can not die but um so yeah that's pretty cool and so let me get some more of these and we can show you the more colorful ones and and that's basically all you have to do is just that. And it, t it does take up water like normal. So then there's that, and that is pretty cool. So then I like that more, so I'm just going to switch that. Ooh, colorful. Still has some of the leather on it, but it's still pretty cool. So this is what purple does. And this is magenta. This is pink. Brown. Whoa! Moved a little bit on myself. This is brown, this is yellow, this is lime green, green, a cyan. What you can even do is combine different dyes together, and it makes these. It's, <laughs> it's crazy what you can do. So try it on your own, and these will all work, but also try on your own, like, different combinations to see what you can make. So, like, let me give you some tips. So, obviously, white will make it brighter. So you can re-dye stuff and it won't mix. And so this will make that. So it's like a sky blue almost. And by the way, brown makes a darker color. So this was like bright red before. If you add brown to it, it makes a darker red. And the same for purple. And this yellow and lime green, it makes like a... I don't know. It's like a really bright green. It's pretty cool. So... That's all you need to do. These are the different, all the different. <laughs> uh, the first ones without the two are the regular dice. And then, yeah, that's how you do it. It's pretty easy. The hardest part is getting a cauldron and making the dice themselves. But then dying, getting leather armor. And that's all you have to do. And it's really awesome for adventure maps to make it more, f your armor fit more in the area. So that's it, and hope you enjoyed this video, and please comment below for any more suggestions for tutorials, and give a like if you enjoyed this tutorial, and if you thought that it helped you actually, <laughs> and thank you guys for all the support, and see you guys again soon, bye!